Today we're going to talk about chapter one in Rescue Your Business on this episode of Title Tuesdays. Hey everybody, welcome back to another fantastic episode of Title Tuesdays. My name is Kevin Thatcher, the founder and CEO here at Independence Title, also known as Your Title King. Today, as I promised, we are going to be kicking off our 15-week episode talking about my newest Amazon.com bestseller, Rescue Your Business. It's going to be the business secrets of an entrepreneur, former firefighter, built a business to a uh, $1.5 million business for the last three years. And I'm gonna go over many of the tips and tricks and business strategies that I learned because what I found of my viewers watching this is they're interested in, in listening about some of the things about title insurance, but they wanna also know business strategies, what's working. I was just speaking at an event the other day where I started talking about the book and the, the whole room got up and everyone came to the back of the room to go buy the book, learn about the book, and they wanna just surround yourselves with successful people. So where do you find yourselves to surround yourself with successful people? Networking events. Networking events are the number one venue that can help build your business. But the problem is most people walk into a networking event without a plan, they walk in with a stack of business cards, and they have no idea what they are looking to accomplish when they walk into that room. So if you're that type of person that fears public speaking, you do not like talking to people, you need to click the link and buy the book. The book is on sale right now for $14.97 on Amazon. You can get it on Barnes & Noble for $10, and you can always stop by the office and pick one up for $10 as well. And the book is going to give you strategies to help make you more successful. So episode one, which is chapter one, we're talking about is industry networking beneficial to your business? And my answer is yes. Regardless of what business you're in, whether you're a firefighter, whether you're a realtor, whether you're an investor, whether you own a title company, industry networking is so beneficial to your business, you need to be able to make significant relationships in this industry. By earning significant relationships, people will know you, like you, and then trust you enough to do business. So how do you do it when you walk into a networking event? At the back of the chapter, we do have a chapter assessment that you can work on, and I'm always willing to help you with it. But what I like to tell people is walk into a networking event with a strategy. Walk in with a plan of attack of what you are looking to accomplish when you leave the event. I just went to Grant Cardone's 10X Growth Con down in Miami a couple of weeks ago, and the one thing I decided to go into is I'm looking to meet three people. I want to look to meet three people that can significantly change my business and I can work on building a significant relationship with those three people. And that's what I want you to do. When you walk into your next networking event, whether it's a chamber of commerce, whether it's some type of local networking organization that runs meetings, whether it's Toastmasters, whether it's um, any other type of BNI, PNA, NPI, any of these networking organizations, you want to walk in with a plan, a plan of attack to meet three people, three people that you can build a quality give relationship to that person. You want to build a relationship with them. You want to get to know them, like them, and trust them. You want to be able to refer business to them, and they will refer business to you. In the book, I talk about how industry networking was so important. I was a, a area director for uh, BNI, Business Network International, many years ago, and I walked into a BNI meeting, and I met an appraiser. Her name was Margie Casey, and she was a fantastic appraiser, and I got to know her like her and trust her. And then you fast forward a few years later, she introduced me to one of her best friends who happened to be a real estate broker that I still do business with today. So the whole idea was I didn't go in for get rich quick. I didn't go in to get business from this person. I went in to build a relationship. I wanted to help her business grow. I wanted to help her grow as a person. I wanted to get to know, like, and trust her as a person and as a business professional. And then you fast forward a few years later and the doors open for significant opportunity. So my strategy for you in this chapter is going to be schedule three networking events over the next three weeks. I want you to go to three networking events. I want you to go in with only three business cards and look to meet three people that can significantly change your business. And now what are you gonna do with these people? Well, you're gonna follow up with them and say, I'd love 
five minutes to get a cup of coffee with you, maybe a phone conversation, and see how can I help you. I just had a breakfast meeting with someone and the first question they asked is, Kevin, tell me how can I help you? Now they scheduled the meeting and then they started off the meeting asking how can they help me? Do you think that made me feel good? It absolutely did. So your goal at your networking event is to meet three people, make them feel good, get to know them, then you'll start liking them. And then once you have the know and the like, you are then going to build a relationship that consists of trust. Mutually beneficial, give, give relationships where you can add value to them and they are going to add value to you. So I hope you learned something new. Please share this video on social media. I know we're gonna start talking about this book over the next couple of weeks. Next week is chapter two. We're talking about the benefits of, of being a philanthropist, about giving back to charity in many different facets to help increase you as a person, which will then increase your business. So don't forget to buy the book because we're gonna go chapter by chapter and you're gonna be all able to follow the assessments that we're talking about every single week when we wanna take your business to the next level. So as always, my name's Kevin Thatcher, the founder and CEO here at Independence Title. My goal is to add value to you, to increase your business, get you more closings, and then when you have more closings, you're gonna say, I wanna call Kevin to do closings with him because I know him, I like him, and I trust him. So don't forget to click the red subscribe button, share on social media, and as always, Kevin Thatcher signing off, and I look forward to seeing you at the closing table.